And this is going to simulate road time. And as you can tell, come take a close look at it, because what you can see is the paint's actually not bonding to the hood. It's spreading out. You have some overspray, but it's actually not, not, a uh, not, not, not sticking to the hood. Is anybody a smoker? Me. Do you have a light here? And really, we're going to do this quick, but the, the funny thing is, we have done this in some dealerships where we do, we spray it on, we leave it all day, we come back at the end of the day, and then it just wipes right off. Yeah. The reason we do this, because A, it's cool to light cars on fire, uh -huh. B, wax-based <laughs> products, turtle wax, all that fun stuff, wax melts at 120 degrees, a nice 90 degree day, up, 90 degree day outside. You, well, your, the hood temperature of your car is well exceeded the 120 degree threshold that wax melts at. Right now, by doing this, we've actually reached the surface temperature of that hood in an infrared, infrared thermometer to 550 degrees. If that was wax, it would have melted. And thus, the damage of the paint that would have set All right. to, the damage of the spray paint would have set it to the paint. Now let's see it come off. Perfect. Oh, no, it doesn't. Oh, great. <laughs> the smiley face. Did you get the agreement signed? <laughs> Here's your lighter back. Now, in addition to the product and the warranty, your customer is going to receive a customer care kit. In that kit, not that we recommend your customers go home and light their cars on fire, they're going to receive this. This is a cleaner. And this cleaner is 80% cleaner, 20% renewer. So as I take the paint off the hood of your car, it's actually putting the protective finish that I applied earlier back into the paint. And voila. Voila. Now the nice thing about this is, if you do happen to have a customer that says, I don't believe in that stuff, I don't think it works, you can check.